Running, 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 smiling from ear to ear, foot caught, brain unaware. Such a flip, it couldn't have been intentional, not even the slightest bit. That childish face, caught by surprise and fear, feels the wind before the fall. Drip, drop, drip. Blood like a ripe cherry, it stains the gravel ground and promotes whales. That innocent, tiny heart, it begins to beat faster. And as the cries slow, they're taken over by shuddering breaths. There is fear, but not of pain. The fear is for what should be done. For what can a child do when everything is pain? Her breathing slows, she finds the pain tiring, and she falls asleep to soundless tears. A father sits and waits for a child that won't come home. He waits till dusk before he goes to search. His child isn't in the front yard, not in the back, not in the house. His child is gone. Fear and instinct wipe out logic. He calls his child's name. And the child wakes up in her father's arms with bruised and bandaged knees, and she stains her shirt with tears of joy. The sun smiles down on them from the heavens, and the birds chirp just a little louder. From then on, the father and the daughter were two feet, never to walk alone.